Hey, Terry. Good morning. How are you? Good, how are you? I'm excellent. Good. Um, we, at long last, are going to do a review of one of the, uh, I guess they're like the DeLonghi Nespresso hybrids. Yes. What do you have here? So this is the DeLonghi Latissima EN680. Okay. So, and this is, yeah, basically DeLonghi and uh, Nespresso partnered up, and this is a great little auto-frothing cappuccino-style um, machine that uses the Nespresso pods. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So, um, basically, one thing that's kind of funky about this one, we'll just start with the bottom and work our way up, I guess. So, okay. this is our little water tank, and we just, or, I'm sorry, our little milk tank. We okay. Just washed it out, so I have some water in there. But 16.9 ounces on that guy. The water tank is underneath. Mm -hmm. So, oh, interesting. 41 ounce water tank, but okay. it goes throughout. Mm -hmm. So this whole cover lifts off. Mm -hmm. This is a little funky getting it off of here. But basically this whole cover lifts off or you can just pour right through here. Mm -hmm. You have a little float right on the front. So you can see this is red when you get low. Otherwise, as you're pouring water in there, the magnet comes up. Okay. Or the float, I guess it's not a magnet. It's just a float comes up. This whole thing slides in. If you have a taller mug, you can push nice. that all the way back. Mm -hmm. And then this whole piece pulls forward too. So if you don't need to get your whole um, water tank out, but you want to empty out your little drip tray here. Okay. So, yep. These two sides aren't drip trays though. So earlier I was dispensing some water and the little trickle of water that was left just kind of pulled on here. <laughs> there aren't any holes through there. Oh, it's just little divot. Yeah. Got it. So, okay. All right, just as an FYI. Mm -hmm. um, but it has your little milk frother and then your water output. And um, so basically these are varying levels of um, uh, programming are right over here on our buttons. Mm -hmm. You can see we've just got it warmed up for coffee right now. Um, this machine has what they call eco mode and it's gonna come factory set at that. And it basically means that when the machine is initially heating up, it's gonna be in this eco, eco mode. Okay. So it's not hot for hot water, it's hot for coffee. Oh, okay. So if you turn it on, these two buttons are illuminate, mm -hmm. illuminated. They're the two that you're ready to use. So you can I use see. your Lungo button or your espresso shot button, mm -hmm. but you can't do your hot water yet until you heat it up to hot water. And you just have to press that to get ready. Press and hold it, I think, for just a second here to and get ready. it yeah. will start doing it for hot oh, water. I'm sorry, you have to put this in. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, why is it's it like, there? No. So, and it's faded, and it will do this light pulsing if it's in energy mode here, okay. or on the hot water if it's in kind of energy mode. So if you press it, then it'll start to heat up. I see, yeah. okay. So you kind of have to like say, wake up. <laughs> and then these would light up if yep. I had Add my this little dude in place exactly so it's smart smarter than me just a second ago. So, <laughs> yep there you go so got it these will light up when you're ready to do your um, cappuccino and your macchiato buttons mm -hmm. latte macchiato and then um, also like the other DeLonghi carafes this has a, a minimum froth level mm -hmm. and a maximum froth level okay so you're basically up or down on your froth with that guy um, Something else that's pretty cool, the clean feature on this one. Mm -hmm. When you press and hold this, it's going to shoot your little steam through there. So you want to put a container under here. Every time you use the milk feature, okay. you want to put your container under here. And then press and hold this. And these buttons will blink. Mm -hmm. And it'll blink for 12 seconds. Mm -hmm. And that's the recommended cleaning time. Okay. So once it's done, it will stop being illuminated. So you don't necessarily have to count to 12. <laughs> you just let the button go. Um, but you do need to stand there and press and hold it for that the whole duration. Yeah. And you know, you can do that actually to get everything all nice and toasty. Absolutely, to, yes. To make your yep. milk hotter. Yeah, exactly. That's and this, cool. yeah, so it gets pretty darn hot as far as the milk goes. Too darn hot? Um, for me, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And then these guys, can I program them? Yep. So okay. for the coffee volumes, it's um, 0.65 for your espresso up to 10 ounces maximum okay. for your coffee. Okay. And um, your milk is also programmable, and that's one ounce to 6.5 ounces. Okay. And you can also program your water output too. So, and that and how do you too. do all that? Do you just yep. like do the press and hold exactly. kind of situation? Yeah. Okay. So it's press and hold for any of them, including the water. And then, you know, just keep that button pressed down until the volume that you like is reached. And then you just let, let it go. go. Okay. And so for the milk ones, I know that's a little funky to think about. Yeah. But it's basically press and hold until you have the volume of milk that you like. Mm -hmm. And then let go. And then press and hold for coffee as well. And I see. Go. So two uh, yeah. phases. Yeah, exactly. Cool. All right. Are you going to make me a cappuccino? Absolutely. All right. We'll be right back. <laughs> okay. So we're using our, our lovely orange in, in the season. <laughs> it's, it's pumpkin October. spice, right? <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> so, pad goes in, close that guy up, and put this under here. What are you thinking? You want to do more? We'll do more foam? Uh, let's do less foam. Less foam? Okay. No, less more foam. foam. Oh, 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 Sorry. Oh. Sorry, I shot a little water out at you. Meow. <laughs> okay, and we'll do this button here. Okay. And it will do its thing. So it does have, <clears> um, <throat> I think it's about 45 to 55 seconds for your heat up time. Oh, for, okay. Yeah, it's pretty quick though, as far as your, your heat up goes. And then um, right there, you have a selection of capsules that comes with a little array. Yep, yep, so it comes array. with your, Yeah, exactly, so you can try before you order. Mm -hmm. Cause you gotta get these from Nespresso. It's very bubbly foam it there, Bob. It is very bubbly, yeah. We were kinda playing around with that a little bit. <laughs> you can kinda swirl and tap that foam in there a little bit. You can texture your milk after. That's right. But it gives you a nice layer of foam. I wanted to it put does. it in a clear cup so you could kind yeah. of see the, the uh, results there. The action. Mm -hmm. See, look at that. Look at mm -hmm. that crazy foam. And it's look, it's orange foam. espresso. It in totally the season. <laughs> it's because it's pumpkin That's espresso. That's right. It's pump espresso. <laughs> pump espresso. But yeah, look at that. Oh. It's pretty, I mean, it's definitely foamy, absolutely. Yeah. But look at that. It's, it's pretty. Definitely an airy foam. Okay. Yeah, definitely an airy foam. You know, so. taste it? Yeah. It's super hot. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah, it's super hot. Ooh, yeah, on the, on mm -hmm. the glass it is. But it's good. It does a good job. It's a nice small footprint. Mm. Has mm -hmm. a cup warmer on the top. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Whoa. All right. Rock okay. Off, like, Whoa, yeah. Ow. Yeah. Totally. <laughs> <laughs> it would have but been yeah. impossible to for us to choose a double wall glass. It's true. Yeah. They were all dirty. <laughs> <laughs> um, cool. Yeah. I liked it. How compact it is. Mm -hmm. And if you have um, uh, a milk drinker and non-milk drinker in the house, you yep. know, you mm -hmm. can. It, it does double duty. Exactly. Yep. If you want to put something in your travel mug, it does have to be a pretty narrow travel mug. Okay. I'm sure we'll put the specs online, but mm -hmm. I tucked a mirror travel mug, and that is perfect. Oh, you can't okay. Go any taller than that. Though, Got it. As far as your travel mugs go. Cool. So. Yeah. All right. Delonghi Latissima yes. EN680. Cool. Yes. All right. Thanks, Terry. Thanks, Kat.